the trip trap bar. Guess we're gonna go and tell Holly. And always has been. I mean, what's his job, really? To keep shit from reaching the woodlands. Jack, I don't know where they are. You're a bar. You're supposed to have darts around. And I normally do, but who knows where the fuck they went to after. Oh, her face. Oh, I freaking love that guy. He Come just, on, everyone's Holly. scared of him. I need entertainment. But he could be like one of the most nicest guys ever. This'll do. <laughs> okay, okay, I know. Just relax. Not here to start anything. Okay. Miss White, I heard you had kind of a strange morning. It's been kind of a strange morning for everyone, I think. Every time I see this guy, he seems to lose weight. It's amazing. It really is. He loses weight and yet somehow keeps all the muscle. Jack. Wolfie, my dear, how are you? Punch you in the face. Don't like him already. He's sarcastic. Because, you know, we were just talking about you. All of us. I just need to talk to Holly. Privately. Alright, just give us a second first. I'm dying to hear about the body that came out of the East River this morning. It was a fable, right? Well, everyone knows. Tweedledee was just here. He said it looked like Snow White. Sure it wasn't Tweedle dumb? Well, no, but he seemed pretty sure. Great. Sorry. Tweedledee said you arrested him for no earthly reason. Kept him locked in the cellar all fucking night. He said you tortured him. Which, I don't know, that seems like a breach of your legislative duties. Baby, come on. You can't be so dumb as Jack, to... Jack, find the off button. Now. <laughs> what is it you doing? You and Gran are all, let's get a posse together when there's no one around. But as soon as the big bad wolf walks in, your tails go between your legs. There's a reason for that. Nerve. What happened? What happened? I'm tired is what happened. Tired of what? Holly. What? Big, look, two fables are dead. And shit, Gren's sister. Holly's sister. Holly's sister has been missing for out. what? A few days now? And we haven't heard word one throw him out. from anyone. Go away, mate. Hey, easy! Ah, fuck! What'd I do? It's an honor. Get out. Ah. Go fuck on up a beanstalk, Jackie boy. Grant, you gotta learn some new lines. Let me tell you. <laughs> Alright then. Actually, have there been any updates? I don't know how to say this to you, Holly. The woman we found in the river. Who was it? I think she's trying to God cry. God fucking damn it! Of course, the dear princess, Snow fucking White, is all safe and sound. Where were you when we reported this weeks ago, huh? Where are you when we ever fucking need you? If you give one ounce of a shit about her, about any of us, she might have been safe. She might have been cared for. She might have been. What happened? All right, we're out. Give her some room. I ain't leaving her with you. No way. I'm not gonna do anything. I ain't that stupid. Just it should have been you. It should have been you, and it wasn't. You, bitch. I understand you're grieving and all, but that was just too far. We recovered this from her personal effects. I thought you might like to have it. I, I didn't know she still had. Could have been used as evidence, but I didn't want to seem like a douche. Would you 
Are you sure? Exit. <sighs> okay. I don't know that much about her life. Honestly, we didn't talk often. She was lost here in the city. She just got swept away by it. Are we two not talking? It seems so fucking petty now, but I just. I didn't want to watch it with her. I think she was off the Monday drugs, but she was looking to pay down debt. It ain't me up to see her that way. Eventually, the only people she owed were at her work. You know, that shithole club, the pudding and pie. The owner, Georgie, with all his fucking fees. It's a crock of shit. That's how they kept her under their thumb, really. Oh. Holly, it's okay. Fees, huh? What kind of fees? Sounds like one of those old company store kinds of ploys, designed to entrap people by keeping them in debt. We can probably learn more at the club. We've got a lead. Maybe we can take it from here. <sighs> Thanks for everything, Holly. Is there, um, is there anything we can do? No. No, I'm better off dealing with things alone. I don't need sympathy and I don't need charity. It's not charity. It's looking out for our own. Is she? Where is she? She's at the business office. She's taken care of. I'm gonna have to go down there and get her. Fuck. Please, we can handle the funeral arrangements. No, no. It's, it's a kind of... It's a formality with trolls. We burn our dead by sunrise or... I don't know. Of course. Okay. Good. Let's go down to the business office and start making the necessary preparations. I don't think we've seen everything that's on the body so far that we can really need. Um, we've seen all the marks and things, and now she's turned into a troll now as well. So I'll go down there now, see what I can find out from the owner. You were good with her. I'm impressed. Really, thanks. It just made everything easier. You're in there, mate. You're in there. Psst. You're in there. Alright, where do I have to go now? I have to go to that club. Go down, interrogate, uh, interrogate a few people there. Get some answers. If there's banging or anything, by the way, that you can hear, guys, it's actually my bitty dragon. I think he's telling me it's time to, to go to bed. Um, considering it's 20 to 2 in the morning. Um, but I think he's telling me to try and go to bed. He's just kind of staring at me with his tail on the on the glass. After he just turned around and smacked his tail on the grass. <laughs> on the glass. Uh, it's funny. He tries to tell me to go to bed. Then as soon as I go to bed, he'll run up. He'll wait for a few seconds, then run up on his log and sleep. Or he'll hide underneath the grass oh, and sleep. Uh, sure. to leave, nice sorry. Surprise. I'm not sure I've seen you here before. You're always welcome, of course. I'm a friend of Georgie's. Where is he? A friend? <laughs> You're in luck. He's here. Come on. I should warn you that Georgie does not like to be bothered when he's working. And he's in kind of a mood right now. It'll be fine. I have a way with <laughs> so I've heard. <laughs> Could be a good or a bad. Depends how I'm feeling. Depending on how he reacts. Seems like some sort of like strip Welcome bar, strip club. It We're is as well, isn't it? To the diverse taste of the Fable community. Your pleasure is our pleasure. Listen, you could be in danger. Oh, sweetie. We're all in danger. That made me jump. Damn, son. Very best of anime. You look like you're trying to take a shit. I 
this guy. Seems like a real prince. You do have a sense of humor. Good. Good luck. <laughs> All right, all right. We need to go and talk to you, stupid no. Smile. You never smile. How many times? What? Hey. Oh, it's you. We're closed. No, not. Keep dancing, you. I didn't say stop. For fuck's sake. You stay right there. Don't even think about sitting down. You, Georgie. Brilliant deduction, Sheriff. What do you want, then? You here for a little taste? Tell you what, come back after midnight, maybe. I can hook you up. No thanks, mate. Or, uh, knowing you, this is probably not quite your style. You'd prefer someone who can take a bit of a beating. I'm not here for that. Oh, I'm not here for that. <laughs> Just stopped in for the chips then. <laughs> Jesus, Big B, you're so corny. I love it though. No, seriously, I love it. No homo. Hashtag no homo. Okay, alright, Sheriff. Just fucking with you. Look, I know why you're here. Are you sure? Listen, Sheriff. Around here, we can't afford to wait for you and your swanky pals to take an interest. We have to look out for each other. When shit happens, I hear about it. Especially if it concerns my livelihood. In that case, I assume you knew Lily was glamour. Of course she was, you dumb kit. She was a troll. No. I mean glamour to look like another fable. Yeah? Well, so what? Who gives a toss? People get up to all kinds of things when nobody's watching. You know, First of all, it's, it's illegal. illegal to impersonate another fable. It's frowned on. It's illegal as long as I don't like it. The 13th floor would never provide a glamour like that. It's strictly black market stuff. Ooh, black market, is it? How exciting. This is exactly what I would expect from a thug like you. Storm in, throw around a bunch of accusations, try to scare people. But you've got fuck all to back it up. And we're all just meant to jump any time the wolf shows his teeth. Sharon Snow's photo seems to work quite a bit. Get that out of my face. This was part of the glamour we found on Lily's body. Take a good look. She was impersonating Snow White. Why? You've got this all wrong. If Lily was doing a special glamour, it wasn't for me. For fuck's sake, I want that kind of eat. Who was she doing it for then? She had clients, Bigby. Maybe one of them was into it. A lot of fucked up people in Fable Town. Like who? Try looking in the mirror. Anyway, now what to do with me? Go on then. Cool it down. Go on, Big B. Cool it down. Turn that shit off. You gonna oh. win me? Go ahead. That's what you wanna do, right? One more time. Who hired? Thank you. Oh no, fuck! That's all I asked for. Yo! Take your sad fucking face where I can't see it! Bloody bastard fucking shit! You proud of yourself, mate? Proud of your little mess? Fuck's sake! Fuck off, hands. Don't take it, man. You're massive. Do you even lift? Hold on a minute. Hans, is it? Hans just cleans up and provides a little muscle when we need it. He's not going to know anything about the girls and their clients or any of that. No one knows. But you get it. It's by design. Discretion is our guarantee, right? And the way we guarantee that is that no one knows anything they don't have to know, including me. I cover my eyes and take my coat. End of story. Why not look it up? What's that? Isn't there a little book with all the stuff about the girls and all that written You're in it? A fucking moron! Show me. There is no book. And as for you, Hans, we need to work on your communication skills and have a fairly good idea where to start. Hey, that's my personal property. Tell me about the book. <laughs> sure, go ahead. 
Do what comes naturally. Tell me about the book. You haven't got the slightest clue about anything. Hey, now. I'm not going to smash anything up. Cut the crap, Georgie. I want the book Hans is talking about. Hans is confused. Again. Don't even think about it. Look, tell me where it is. Why don't you just tell me where the book is? Can we please not go round and round about this? There's no book. End of story. Did you get that book? End of story? <laughs> do not touch that. You hear me? There's nothing to do with you. There's still time for you to just cough it up. I'm sorry, Sheriff, but there's no Andy Magic book with everything you want to know jotted down inside. I sincerely wish there was. Maybe it would get you off me back. Ready now. Well, well, what's this? Looks like a floor safe. Uh, I wouldn't know. It was here when we moved in. I don't have a key to it. Don't need it. Sheriff, will you come on? Fuck's sake, I've got to open up in a few hours. Just give me the book. That's all I need to do, then I can clear off. Give it to me. You're a big bad bastard. We get it. Everyone's guilty. You fucking get it. Jesus, you're killing me. I'm begging you. I'll pay you. Two women are dead. Then quit being a bloody idiot. Come on, it. Leave it. There's nothing there for you. You might want to stand back. All right, all right, all right. I didn't actually smash anything, so I got it. I got it eventually. So I've done a good thing. Bloody come on, then. Didn't actually do anything wrong. Once again, don't get your hopes up. There's nothing in here that'll tell you anything. It's a kick to the balls for me and my club, so you can be happy about that. So tell me, Georgie, who's this Mr. Smith? Oh dear, I'm afraid it might be a fake name, Bigby. Secrecy is sort of how this all works. Even Hans knows that. What's 207? Room number? I don't fucking know. Millimeters, maybe? Don't bullshit me, Georgie. This is your book. Your girls. Not the fucking secretary. I give them a stage. I give them music. I provide an erotic venue to attract and retain clients. But let's be clear on something. Someone's there. The girls make the arrangements with their clients, not me. It's the that girl. Girls. The girl They're that was dancing. She's the other side of that door. Whatever happens outside the club, He's got a spot. Yeah, so. Love the business, take my cut, and I'm out. He's got to go talk to now, her. I've had quite enough of you and your bullying. Excuse me while I call your superiors to make a complaint. Can't talk to her. Let's go. Let's go and talk to her and then Hello. see what she has to say. Business office. Oh, cosmetics. Lipstick. Change. Lipstick, lip gloss, compact, glitter. And a few cents, I guess. As it's America. Um, nope. Faith, thanks for covering. Let's talk before you go over to the apartment. Lily. Looks like they both saw one of Lily's clients. Okay. Um. Cubby. Didn't I just put that in there? Um, and another one. This is Face. <sighs> Jewelry box. Box been busted open. There's something in there. Oh, they've both been searched. Because they look like they've both been broken. Yeah, oh, they've been no. searched. There isn't even a lock. 
Um, so I'll just go back down and see what's in there. Is that like a locket? Do you know you have the lockets with like family members? Um, let's check that again because obviously something's there so otherwise surely it wouldn't make me do it again. Uh, should pick up these. No, okay. Um, anything over this side? Excuse I'll just sit down. I heard you out there. I don't remember ever seeing you here before. Didn't have a reason, have a reason to come here before. Yeah. The lips look no different. Sorry. You're trying to place me. They used to call me the Little Mermaid. Once upon a time. Does that help? What are you doing here? Same as anyone. It's a place where I am. Where else am I supposed to be? Anywhere but here. My name is Nerissa. Well, Nerissa, I've got some questions. Of course you do. I don't have answers. You'll have to find those yourself. Um, two or so. Does the number two zero seven mean anything to you? I assumed it was a room number, but where? You can't talk about work. This is a murder case. I mean, can't. These lips are sealed. Discretion is our guarantee. It's how things work here. People keep using those phrases. What does it mean? I'm not gonna be horrible. This is what I need to know about. Lily's last entry. Who's Mr. Smith? Where's room 207? I have to know. These lips. Sheriff Wolf, would you like to make an appointment with me? Hell yeah. Don't even need to know. I need 150. It's not good to be short. Looking for what I have. This She's obviously needs it. All I've got. Wait here for a second. Okay. So, am I going to get any special treatment or anything? Toy four, not two oh seven. You'll think of something. The open arms. Hmm. This is where they met. Enjoy your stay. Hope you find what you're looking for. She's a nice woman. I feel sorry for her. Where is this gonna take us? Quick cash. Uh, got another police officer there with some other women walking out. It's got the open arms hotel. Okay, that's the hotel. Okay. I don't trust him. Okay, so we're going into the open arms hotel. Okay then. See what's in here.